Welcome to Ella's Beef Easter's Radio Air Check and Classic TV Channel. This is Gossard from WPIX. That's Gossard from WPIX on a Christmas Day, 1971. And um, I might ask you, and I want to thank you, first of all, for every Christmas card that I've received. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of cards, I think, from from, from Connecticut down to Pennsylvania, everywhere, all around New York listening area. And I want to thank you very much for it. And um, um, tonight, here in the studio, I ask you please uh, not to call, because I won't be able to pick up the phones. I'm the only one here tonight. We had a... Uh, um, a death in the family, which kind of uh, messed everything up for Christmas Eve for us. But, uh, hey, we got records. January the 15th, right? January the 15th at the New York Academy of Music. I will be bringing you my eighth original rock and roll show. I will have on stage with me there Mary Wells, Jimmy Beaumont and the Skyliners, the Earls, Earl Lewis and the Channels, the Willows, The Charts, The Roommates, The Eternals, Shirley and Lee, The Royal Teens, and Little Anthony and The Imperials. That's January the 15th. The Imperials, Mary Wells, Skyliners, Earls, Channels, Willows, Charts, Roommates, The Eternals, Shirley and Lee, and The Royal Teens. You can get your tickets at Rock Magazine, 166 Lexington Avenue. It's between uh, 30th and 31st Streets here in the city on Lexington, 166 Lexington Avenue. Tickets are four fifty, five fifty, and six fifty. You can call seven two five five eight four five. The telephone number seven two five five eight four five. It'll only be on Saturday night, but there'll be two shows on Saturday: one at eight, one at eleven. That's Saturday night, January the fifteenth, at the New York Academy of Music for my eighth original rock and roll show. Hope to see you there. Oh, boy, Stan's going to faint when he sees me driving to the driveway with all these packages. <laughs> <laughs> oh, anyway, where was I? Oh, let me finish. Yeah, so she says to me, uh, listen, do you take good care of your health? And I said, good care of my health? Are you kidding? I mean, nobody takes better care. Two aspirin at the first sign of a cold, right? I mean, a quart of orange juice every day, four kinds of vitamins. Oh, gee, and... Alice, I wish I were that careful. Do you get chest x-rays and all those things? Well, you better believe it. Chest x-rays twice a year, electrocardiograms every four... Alice, don't you wear your seat belt? My what? Your seat belt. Oh, this thing. And I figure if you're gonna go, you're gonna go. No matter how much or how little you look after your health, please look after your life. If you're driving now without your seatbelt fastened, pull over, stop, and put it on. This message was brought to you by the General Motors Corporation. Barney Google's Christmas Blast from the Past. Hey now, hey now, hey now, hey now. This Monday, December 27th, the one and only Hank Ballard and the Midnighters. The exciting Hank Ballard, creator of the twist for one big night at Barney Google's. See and hear the show-stopping Hank Ballard recreate his all-time great hits. This Monday, December 27th, two shows, 9.30 and 11.30. Always action at Barney Google's, dancing 9 to 3 a.m. New Year's Eve, Golden Gasser Blast at Barney Google's. Starring the Mellow Kings, Kenny Chandler and Stoney N. Dinner and show, don't miss it. Make your reservations now and treat yourself to wild nights of fun and doo-ops at Barney Google's, where the rock revival started. For reservations and information, call 722-9819. Barney Googles, 225 East 86th Street in the heart of Singles Land. Don't forget Hank Ballard and the Midnighters this Monday, December 27th at Barney Googles. And make your New Year's reservations now. Don't miss out. Dinner, dance, and show. Barney Googles, fabulous New Year's Eve Golden Gasser Blast. Starring the Mellow Kings, Kenny Chandler and Stoney End. All right, folks, don't forget about Finnegan's Rainbow, 61st Street and Roosevelt Avenue. It's like 10 minutes over the 59th Street Bridge in Woodside, Queens. They're closed tonight. But uh, they want to wish everyone a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And uh, speaking about New Year's, Finnegan's Rainbow has an evening lined up for you on New Year's. Headlining their New Year's Eve party will be the Harp Tones, right? Harp Tones will be at Finnegan's Rainbow, New Year's, you know. And you can join the Harp Tones also with them uh, playing will be a group called Lazarus, uh, who's into like a, a jazz rock thing there. And they'll have a uh, bar will start at about 8 o'clock in the evening. Kitchen will be open for sandwiches and grilled items. And there'll be plenty of hats and noisemakers and live music from 10 o'clock in the evening to 5 in the morning. So it's the Harp Tones and Lazarus at Finnegan's Rainbow, 61st Street and Roosevelt Avenue, just 10 minutes over the 59th Street Bridge in Woodside, Queens. Give them a call at 639-3200.
It's all going to happen at Carnegie Hall Thursday, December 30th, when Richard Dagger and Ron Delsner present in concert the pioneers of rock and roll music, Chuck Berry and Jerry Lee Lewis. He got into the attic of the New Orleans. We're back up in the woods among the evergreens. Two shows, the rock reunion at Carnegie Hall. Chuck Berry and Jerry Lee Lewis, the giants of rock and roll and the most incredible show in all of New York with the Bobby Comstock Band. Just let me hear some of that rock and roll music. Goodness me. Great ball of fire. Carnegie Hall, Thursday night, December 30th. Chuck Berry and Jerry Lee Lewis in the last great show of 71. Hey, I want to switch back, you know, and catch uh, another Drifter's tune. You know, they did like the uh, the Christmas song. But they did a thing which is very, very beautiful that some of you might not have heard, which is, uh, I remember... Thank you, judges. Folks, uh, <coughs> hang on. <laughs> I'm starving, you know. I got up late today. So I stopped at a deli and picked up a sandwich and some uh, pretzels and a thing of salad here for my uh, Christmas dinner. So I just met right back. Something weird. Have you ever felt the chill of terror creeping into your heart? Have you ever been confronted by that which is unbelievable? Well, my friend, prepare yourself for all that is terrifying. The World Festival of Magic and Occult. Now through Sunday, January 2nd, at the Felt Forum in Madison Square Garden Center. See the world's greatest illusionists, magicians, and occult practitioners performing unimaginable feats. Escapology, witchcraft. The World Festival of Magic and Occult, a phantasmagoria of fearful happenings. See it if you dare. Now through Sunday, January 2nd, at the Felt Forum in Madison Square Garden Center. Call 564-4400. Don't forget, please be advised that segments of two acts of this show contain material which may not be suited for the young or the sensitive. But remind you on... Uh, Finnegan's Rainbow at 61st Street and Roosevelt Avenue over in uh, Woodside, Queens. Not open tonight, but on New Year's Day, I invite you to come and hear the harp tones along with Lazarus. Lazarus like a jazz rock group, you know. Well, um, at Finnegan's Rainbow, the harp tones will be there New Year's. They'll have live music from 10 p.m. in the evening till 5 o'clock in the morning. Plenty of hats, noisemakers, sandwiches, and grilled items. And uh, they'll have a uh, big New Year's Eve champagne toast on the house. Okay. Uh, the 61st Street and Roosevelt Avenue, 10 minutes over the 59th Street Bridge in Woodside, Queens. The reservations, you can call 639-3200. Finnegan's Rainbow. New Year's, they've got the harp tones there. My son could chew all day long and then put it on the dresser and pick it up the next morning. <laughs> I'm very happy Wendy <laughs> stopped by to see us on Christmas. That. This is Bill Mazur. I'm speaking with Mrs. Wendy Peacock of Crown Good Heights, Miss Peacock. Brooklyn. That's Mrs. Sam. Peacock, do you recommend Trident Sugarless Gum to your neighbors? I have. And family. What happened? Like it. You know, four out of five dentists surveyed recommend sugarless gum for their patients who chew gum. That's why so many mothers have turned to Trident. You seem pretty sold on Trident, too. I always stick with Trident. I didn't believe that a gum that didn't have any sugar would taste good. And I found that it did. And that the flavor surpassed the, the sweetness of it. You know, the flavor's so good, you don't realize it hasn't got sugar in it. Four out of five dentists surveyed recommend sugarless gum for their patients who chew gum. Trident. Many delicious flavors, including cinnamon. Ask your dentist about Trident. I certainly will do that, sir. Certainly will do that. There's a, um, a thing I want to mention. Later on tonight, folks, I'm going to be presenting to you uh, the Amos and Andy Christmas Show, which was run somewhere around the early 50s, I believe, somewhere right around there. And uh, along with that, I'll have some very special records, super collector's records, that are worth somewhere over $300 right now. Right. Playing a couple of those for you this evening. And as well as, uh, um, I brought a whole bunch of tapes in, a special Christmas things. And uh, as they come up, uh, I can't just exactly remember what they are right now, but I'll, uh, I'll keep <laughs> pulling, pulling them out here in just a second. <laughs> Bell. Hey, you know, we've been through the 50s and the 60s, and uh, now we're here in the 70s, almost into 72. But we have the greatest 1950s styled album that's ever been made. The New York Doo-Wop Album, Volume 2. It captures all the magic of the 50s and its music, 
its cover, and in its plastic, because the plastic is solid gold plastic. And on it, there's 22 oldies in all, all on one super album with Bring Back Those Doo-Ops on My Word of Honor. I'm Just Another Dancing Partner. My uh, Heart Cries, You Never Love Me, Mommy and Daddy, Deep in My Heart, Can I Come Over, Bad Girl, Memories of El Monte, Ballad of a Boy and Girl, and more with the platters, monotone, shells, dubbed students, miracles, penguins, the five discs, the nutmegs, the young tones, and there's even more than that. This is a New York album, folks, made for New York by the people who really care about the real New York. That is, and I'm quoting our mail, not laying a sales pitch on you, one of the only genuine oldie albums ever made. We have volume one out, which is red, and this is volume two, it's in gold. Both of them have 22 oldies on them. So to put this album in your personal collection, where you enjoy it for as long as you enjoy rock and roll music, you just write to Records, Box 2, Town Center Branch, West Orange, New Jersey. $5 covers all the shipping and packaging right to your door. You just send to Records, Box 2, Town Center Branch, West Orange, New Jersey. The zip code is 07052. This is Gus Gossert, your curly-headed kid in the second row. I'll be here till midnight tonight on WPIX in New York. Till midnight with 1950s rock and roll Christmas records. Right here in Santa Town, USA. Bow, 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 bow. in the crisis, Santa Town, USA, which has to be New York City, you know. He, remember, it was about 1962, and over the holidays in 62, there was a super smash by the guy that was making the different monster records. His name was Bobby Pickett, and since he did a takeoff on Boris Karloff, they called him Bobby Boris Pickett, and he had this particular record. Bobby Boris Pickett with the Monster's Holiday. This is Gus Gossard, and... Um, as long as we're in a blues type of thing. Probably one of the finest blues performers. Alongside Charles Brown. It must be... Freddie King's really got himself going something there, doesn't he? I hope to tell you. All right, folks, I do want to tell you about a couple of things. First of all, about your uh, pencil and paper, if you can write this down. About the New York Doo-Wop album, Volume 2. There are 22 solid sounds in all. Has Bring Back Those Doo-Wops by the Baghdads. On my word of honor, I'm just a dancing partner by the platters. Mommy and daddy, and my heart is an open door. The students, you never love me. The monotones deep in my heart. The shelves, ballad of a boy and girl by the graduates. Bad girl by the miracles. My heart cries, Edna and Harvey. The penguins do memories of El Monte. Plus uh, the bells of Rosarita, you told another lie. Facts of love with the dubs, youngsters, young tones. Jesse Belvin, the continentals, the five discs, the fluorescence and the arcades. And it's only available by mail, now don't forget. 
It costs five dollars per album and includes everything, you know, packaging, shipping, right to your record player. And you can get it from Records, Box 2, Town Center Branch, West Orange, New Jersey. The zip code is 07052. Volume 2, my second original New York doo-wop album, is available to you for five bucks from Records, Box 2, Town Center Branch, West Orange, New Jersey. Zip code 07052. I hope you can pick that up. And also, as long as I'm right here, let me mention that I will be bringing you my eighth, the eighth original rock and roll show here in New York. It will be at the New York Academy of Music January the 15th. That's a Saturday night. It's one night only, a Saturday night, January the 15th, right? It'll be at the New York Academy of Music. There'll be two shows at 1 at 8 and 1 at 11. And I will have with me on stage at the Academy of Music on the 15th of January, Saturday night, Mary Wells, the Skyliners, the Channels, the Willows, the Charts, the Little Anthony and the Imperials, the Roommates, the Eternals, the Royal Teens, and Shirley and Lee. That's Saturday night, January the 15th. To get your tickets, stop down to Rock Magazine. 166 Lexington Avenue between 30th and 31st, or you phone 725-5845. Got that? 725-5845 for my January the 15th, 8th original rock and roll show at the New York Academy of Music. Tickets 455, 50, and 650 at Rock Magazine between 30th and 31st Streets on Lexington Avenue here in the city. Little Anthony and the Imperials, Mary Wells, the Scar 65, okay? 1965. Um, the group was the Poets. The record was Merry Christmas Baby. You know, there's a whole, been a whole lot of country records that were made also in regards to like uh, Christmas rock records. Well, one that was made a long time ago, and if you ever get down to Nashville, in the area where they sell all of the um, country and western records and all the, the clothes are made for the country and western artists that appear at the Grand Old Opry, um, you'll see a record store there called Ernest Tubbs Record Shop. And outside hangs a guitar with lights all around it and so on. And inside, very often during the week, you'll find Ernest Tubb. Well, he did a record a long time ago about trimming his tree, right? with teardrops. This is Gossard from WPIX-FM in New York City. Folks, reminding you, thank you, Skippy, um, that on January the 15th, I will be bringing you my eighth original rock and roll show at the New York Academy of Music. Charlie, we're up from Philadelphia, man, read news on Christmas. Where well, you, going, you going back tonight? You're going to yeah, stay in New York. going back tonight. You don't have anything clicking? Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> uh, all right. Soviets say Mars 2 and Mars 3 carried instruments to determine life on Mars. Jules made a record too about uh, snowflakes and teardrops. Which is very nice. On WPIX. Snowflakes and teardrops and heartaches that won't stop because he went away. My winter's here to stay and I will love Thank you. 
Thank you, Angels. This is Gus Gossard from WPIX in New York on a Christmas Day night, December 25th, 1971. And if I could call on the illustrious Freddie, there's a whole bunch of stuff. I want to play one of those super rare records in, uh, in just a second for you. But uh, let me let you know who some of our sponsors are throughout the year, and I'll be right back. <laughs> The record store that really takes care of your record. This is Gus Gossard from WPIX on a Christmas, and I want to do a record from 1954 by a group known as the Chanticleers. This is off of a 78, and um, the whole thing came out of Newark, New Jersey at that time. Yuletide Love. A collector's item. Declares from 1954. Things called Yuletide Love. This is Gossard from WPIX. Now, ladies and gentlemen, from the Ed Sullivan Show. On Christmas. Thank you very much. Uh, Here's a song from my album, friends. Uh, before we do this song, I'd like to tell everybody that uh, that they made this the best Christmas that we've ever had. We would like to thank everybody for all the wonderful Christmas presents and Christmas cards and birthday presents that came in. I got exactly 282 teddy bears <laughs> for the Christmas holidays. We have the walls lined with them. And uh, I'd like to tell you uh, that we deeply appreciate it. We're sorry that we couldn't give each one of you a new Lincoln, but they wouldn't sell us that many. Well, I went to my blue.